did you know that sometimes skin infections and throat infections can cause rheumatic fever? Uh, no, I didn't. Okay. Also, some children don't go to doctors as often as they should, okay? And often just detected very late because patients, doctors, nurses are not aware of the condition. So, everybody should know about this and learn about this, maybe through regular visit to our health clinics. Exactly. Understanding the importance of really minor problems, you know, a sore throat is a really minor problem. But we need to make sure that everybody knows in the communities that it's a very important problem. That sore throat is the result of an infection by the highly contagious Group A Streptococcus bacteria. It's commonly called strep throat. If left untreated, this throat infection can lead to acute rheumatic fever. This is when a child's antibodies, the inside hunters that protect the body by getting rid of invaders that may cause harm, destroy the strep bacteria. The problem is, in some children, these hunters also attack the heart, which contains similar looking proteins to those of the invaders. 